what is going on guys going to be doing a little largemouth and peacock fishing today I got my uh, victory rod from St. Croix uh, 7 foot 1 inch uh, medium power fast action got a 2500 Shimano Sahara some 10 pound mono and then the lure we're going to be starting with and I hope we could finish with this one is a little Nico Helgramite this is the galaxy color basically black with some uh, very bright blue and sparkly glitter flakes and that is on a small 1 8 ounce jig head so we're going to throw this thing around this lake uh, this this lure if you've been watching my previous videos is one of my go to's for peacocks and large mouths absolute killer lure so we'll throw that thing around and hopefully we get into some peacocks and large mouths so let's give it a shot All right, so here's the lure we are going with. A little bit better look, Nico Helgramite. We'll flip this thing around. I'm just gonna let it sink, not all the way to the bottom, but I like to kind of swim this thing back to us slowly and then twitch it a little bit. And that usually produces a good amount of action. So let's see if there are any fish out of here hungry for a Helgramite today. Fish on. Oop, stay down. Little guy. Oh, and he's off. I uh, hate when they jump. Wasn't a big guy. Maybe a, I don't know, 12, 14 inch largemouth. But still disappointing when you lose a fish. There we go, fish on. Another little one, another little large map, but this guy is on the bank. All right, so first fish on the bank, about the same size as that first one I lost, so definitely not big, but one is always better than none. So this guy's going back, well, let's get us something bigger. Here we go, fish on, another little guy. Alrighty, second fish of the day, same size as the last one we caught and also about the same size as that one we lost way in the beginning, so all small fish today. So very, very slow day, but I will take it. Alright, so two little dink bass is all we've got to show for our efforts today. But sometimes you gotta work through the little ones to find the big ones. I've been fishing this pretty, pretty slow. A couple twitches here and there. And kind of on the edges of all the grass lines, it's probably a little hard to see. But there's a nice drop off, maybe 20 feet from us. And that's where the grass line is. All three hits have really come kind of right on the edge of that grass line. So I've been trying to work this along the grass lines because there should be some fish hanging out there waiting for something small to swim out of the grass so they could ambush it. So let's keep going. 
Let's try to get ourselves another one, hopefully one that's a little bit bigger. Fish on. Another little guy. Little largy. Alright, larger mouth number three. Can't find any any with any sort of size on him. All these little dinks are all we're getting today. Fish on. Oh, that's a Mayan. Oh, there's a peacock behind it. Too bad the peacock didn't hit it and this Mayan did. Alrighty, our first Mayan of the day. I don't normally get a lot of these on the Helgramite, but we got, we got one today. Unfortunately, oh, what is that? Those are some peacocks busting the water. Let me get this guy back quick. Alright, so I don't know what those peacocks were ambushing, and I don't, I don't think this is the best lure for those. But, let me see if I could still find one of those peacocks that were busting water right there. Oh, there we go, yes, no! Okay, okay, okay. I had one to hit. Missed the hook set on him. Might have had him hooked for a second. Oh, come on. Oh, there's one right there. Hold on. Let me just drop this down in front of him. Let's see. Oh. That's a nicer one. Nice peacock. Well, I don't know about nice, but definitely the biggest of the day. Come on up here. Alrighty, first peacock of the day. Not a big one, but a pretty good size one. Glad I stopped in the spot at the right time. There we go, got another. Right off of this drop off, this one's a little bit smaller. But these peacocks, even the small ones, put up a nice fight. Oh, and he's off. Yeah, so I think that school of blitz and peacocks moved on because I haven't seen any or gotten a hit here in several minutes but always weird to see a freshwater blitz I'm used to like the stripers and bluefish blitzes up in the northeast and saltwater but I don't really see too many freshwater blitzes so that's always a cool little sight and we got one nice peacock out of it That peacock came out of nowhere. I was about to pull this lure out of the water and he's off. Oh man, that peacock came out of nowhere. I was about to pull my lure out of the water. That guy smashed it, but 
I think we're going to call it on that because that is, that's a disappointment. I don't know. If, uh, he was definitely hooked, but definitely not well. Alright, so that is going to do it. I would consider that probably about as average of a day as I could possibly have. Uh, caught three dink large mouths, caught one nice peacock, lost two other peacocks, so I, I think average is a good word uh, for that. Again, all fish came on the Nico Helgramite, one of my absolute favorite lures, and this is probably my new favorite color. I don't know if it catches more fish, but I think it's, in my opinion, it's the most beautiful uh, color of all the Helgramites that they make. Uh, and super, super durable. I've used this now for three videos. It is still in as good shape now as it was when I pulled it out of the box. Super, super stretchy and durable. Those peacocks, large mouths, and mines. Ooh, I caught a mine, forgot about that. All those fish uh, could not destroy this thing, so great little lure. Nice day, really hot out here, but at least we got some fish on the bank. So I hope you guys liked it, and I will see you next time.